Subscribe to Andrio Tech and press the bell icon to get our latest videos. Hi guys, in this video I will show you how to fix the Angelo ROM which has data connection bug and other smaller bugs. To install this ROM you need to have a TWRP recovery. CWM recovery is not compatible with this ROM. Now to install this ROM you have to download all these files from the link in the description below. Now let me show you the ROM. The ROM is Angelo ROM A7 2017 port for Samsung Galaxy Note 3. The size of this ROM is 1.18 GB. To fix this ROM which has data connection bugs and other smaller bugs you have to download all these files. Do not skip any file. Download all the files. Now to install this ROM first you have to boot into your recovery. If you don't know how to manually go into your recovery, press the power button, the volume up button and the home key at the same time. This will take you to your recovery. Now after entering into your recovery, before installing the ROM, select on the wipe option and then click on advanced wipe and wipe Dalvik system data and cache and swipe to wipe after you are finished with the wiping steps go back and select on the reboot option and click on the power up option after your device is completely turned off hold the power button the volume down button and the home key at the same time. This will take you to your download mode. Now after entering into your download mode, connect your smartphone through a USB cable and connect it to your computer. Now once you have entered into your computer, open the Odin software. Now as you can see that my device has been added. If your device is not shown over here, you should install the Samsung drivers. Now check the BL option and select the sboot file. Select the sboot file and then click on open. And then check the CP option and select the modem file and then click on open and then click on start after the process is completed your device will reboot now after entering into your recovery select the install option and Install your ROM. My ROM is on an USB drive so I will install it from there. First, install the ROM. The installation of this ROM may take up to 2-3 to three minutes. Now once the installation is completed, go back and click on the fix option and flash the KB languages fix. After flashing it, once again go back and then flash the S browser fix.
and then flash the gaps that is the google apps now let me fast forward the video a little bit Now after the gaps are installed, go back and reboot your system. The first boot may take up to 5 minutes. Now as you can see my ROM has booted up and the welcome screen has been shown. Now let me complete my setup. Let me show you whether the data connection on this ROM is working or not. Now as you can see my mobile data is turned on but it is not working over here. Now to fix this error you have to once again boot into your recovery. Boot into your recovery. Now once you have entered into your recovery, click on the install option and select the USB OTG storage and then go to the fix folder and then click on the install image option and select the boot.img file and then click on recovery and swipe to confirm the flash. After you have flashed this, go back and once again go back and then click on the install option and flash the telephony jar file after flashing this flash the mag magisk fix After you are done with all the steps, click on the reboot system option. Now let me show you whether my data connection is working or not. Now as you can see I have fixed the bug of the data connection. Thank you for watching my video guys. Please like and subscribe for more videos like this. And if you like this video, 
please press the like button below this video and if you want the review of this rom you can check out my channel thank you guys for watching my video